I just sold my brand, my newer uh, Tundra to get something older. So we just bought the uh, Suzuki Vitara here. It's a manual five speed four by four. And the seller also has this uh, samurai. samurai, but it's been sold. So we, he has awesome uh, taste in cars. So I'm just showing you a quick, uh, kind of, yeah, he's got the four door sidekick here also, automatic. Yeah, he's got good tasting vehicles, so we uh, saw his he's ad. He's got good tires on all his cars. Most people don't have good tires on their yeah, cars. Yeah, oh, yeah. Every time we buy a car, we gotta buy new tires. Gotta put money into <laughs> it right away. <laughs> I don't think. So it's sold now. It's, we bought the red one. But now you know. They have these little trains we go and ride that oh, we okay. sit on too. I've got, I got one in, got one in Dallas, Texas. I got one in Wyoming. State of Wyoming, one in Wisconsin. He whiz. Okay, about 10 of them. Nope. Two buildings? Yeah, from scratch. That's awesome. Wow. The buildings are just out of paper. That's so wow. neat. Wow. That's crazy. So we are at uh, Bentley Motorsports. 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 Bentley Look at that detail on that, so neat. All the old uh, trains and buildings up there. Dang, thank you, Ben, for showing us this. Yeah, it's amazing. We love me. Here on Little Nottawa Lake, we're gonna try to go through the channel, but uh, it's all overgrown. So we're gonna cruise around and enjoy the scenery. I wanted to go underneath the highway over there. But just me and Autumn. Hello. <laughs> Got the sun in her eyes. Yeah. Highway's right over there, I-69. And then over there, there's a ch uh, channel that goes underneath the highway. And then on the other side, you used to be able to rent uh, little boats or canoes. It's all overgrown. We're enjoying it out here. There's the Suzuki Vitara that we bought yesterday. Looking pretty clean. Running uh, real, real nice. We uh, drove it from uh, Marshall to uh, Coldwater. We are out here. I'm gonna take the boat out with our overheated dog right now. There's Coldwater Lake. Pretty good sized lake out here in uh, Southern Michigan. Take out the Aleco. Around like a clown. That's a little pet. There's not like it when you touch him in the water. Mm -mm. Good boy. Stop. Chubby. Shell. Bunch of them. Good, huh? Take the king there. Where's this little bit? It's like a muscle or something. It looks like it. Oh yeah. Yep. Yeah. I'm gonna I got some rolled up ones. nibble your toes. Come on, see if my arms are ready to do it. <laughs> Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. I see. Leave it. Leave it. No. <laughs> Dad hold me. Dad hold me. Why do you have to be on the <laughs> Oh my gosh, it's so fragile. 
Yeah. Hey, don't do that. Mm, Bob, so. no, he might. Private. Come on, Bob. Yeah. No. No. He's like, no. Gross. Boy, I said, come here. <laughs> Boy, I said, come here. Boy? He said, no, Dad, no. He said, but I said, no. Good boy. You simming? You listen. You simming? He said, no, I'm not swimming. <laughs> They've got the whole lake to themselves. Down here. He's swimming. Look a good boy. Uh, come back. Please come back because boats. Is it okay? Lake in cold water. We drove down the chain of lakes and it's beautiful. Cruz is having a good time. He wants to play, play, play. Play, play time, huh? Autumn's having a good time. Play, play, play. What are you doing, skimming for shells? Yeah. Sweet. I lost that one shell. What is all that stuff over there? All those ducks. Oh, you just went totally. <laughs> oh, it's so cute.
over there? What? It's colder over there? People probably peed over here. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Yeah, it's from the birds. Come here and take a picture with me. Nice little sandbar right here if you guys come out to this lake. Oh, soften some spots, but they gotta watch out. But it's murky. There's a couple spots you can stand on. Straight off this, uh, like a duck line right there, looks like. Just... Those trees remind me of like up north, up north, like the UP. Right. You hear the crop duster out in the field? Field. And we got good news. What got, what happened today? Got an offer on the house. We got an offer on the house. You know how that goes. I can follow through, but so Never far know. it seems like a pretty stable offer. Had a couple on the table, but yeah, I think the one that rose to the top of the <laughs> heap might work. Well, we'll see. We'll find out. Time will tell. How are they? We're not worried about it. No, I like my house. These are good. Are they good? Pretty good. Let me try one. I, mean, I don't need a bunch of chips anymore, but. I like to try new chips. I love anything onion flavor. I used to dip onions, or funions, in the old uh, McDonald's mayonnaise back in the. <laughs> this is the Aleco, uh 10.5, 10.6 foot boat. This is the uh, air floor. So. Look at the stability of this thing. I'm right here on the edge. It's solid. Nice little boat. I mean, you're not going to take this. You're not going to go in the ocean with ocean, it. You know, too much. I don't recommend like. I mean, you could. High tides. <laughs> for uh, one or two people, if you want to do some high speed boating, and if, even if you wanted to pull somebody, you could pull somebody behind this with one or two people on board. It's a lot of fun on the inland lakes. Um, Michigan is known for lakes there's a lake 
every five miles. A bunch of big ones. Give or orange, take. Go black. Houghton. But anyways, this is just a cool little option if you wanted something inexpensive. I think we have like 2500 bucks into this whole ordeal if you were to count the value of our Evan Rude. I was getting it registered and everything. Getting registered and everything, yeah. But stable, fun little boat. Michigan needs their taxes. Yeah. <laughs> nice uh, lifeline around here, and then the cover goes. We got, got a winter cover for it, too. The wet, uh, cover goes on the outside of all this. So that's sweet. And a lot of people use the Aleco cover for different uh, inflatable boats, too. So that's pretty cool. Sure. Decent quality. They're all, a lot of these are made in the same Chinese factory. Good, we'll put the uh, link in the description for the uh, boat and some other stuff. We have a nice little uh, uh, battery powered inflator that we have for this too. That yeah. thing's amazing, it's uh, a lifesaver. Yeah, you really need something with a digital readout to get really Hard. good accuracy. Uh, so then you can inflate this you know, use the manufacturer's rating and then get, you know, fine tune it from there. That's what I, I did. We found a good spot to keep this at. And yeah, that was great. So like I said, we'll just put a link in the description for all the stuff that we use. There's another airboat on the water too here. And there's, yeah, another inflatable on the other side. Maybe like a Mercury or something, old Mercury inflatable or something. They're out in the middle of the lake swimming. I love inflatables. Florida, I'd take on the inflatable and just bounce around to the big boats and see if I could do any odd jobs to make some money. extra money. Waxing and scraping barnacles, or back then you just use muriatic acid for everything. <laughs> it's probably not good. Probably not. Oh. <laughs> this is our Sunday fun day. Snacking and relaxing. Not shooting some people out of this. Nope. <laughs> That's funny. So the sun is setting out here on the lake. We're going to be out here for a couple more hours, but uh, we're not going to be able to film, so we're just saying goodbye because it's going to be dark. Nice out here, though. It's peaceful. Peaceful. Quiet out here. Making us uh, look for houses on the lake. Or a home base, at least. Nice out here, though. Get a new light mounted. Yeah. Is my new light right there? I just put it on the motor because that was the highest point, but I'll turn it on for you real quick. That's about it. Get the job done. Turn it off if someone's gonna think I'm asking for help or something. I'm gonna ask him for help. No asking for help. I'll roll back if we break down. <laughs> nice little breeze out here. Anchor has us not moving anywhere. Not moved an inch. All right, so we're we're in our uh, Aleco inflatable boat with the winter canopy on it. Just kind of showing you how the canopy looks. It probably won't show up on camera too well, but there's a couple little pinholes that we noticed. That this is brand new; we just put it on. So, just giving you the what's what on this. But uh, otherwise, it fits pretty decently. It's just a cheap little canopy. 
it's not going to be for uh, it's not going to be long term you know it's not going to last probably 10 years or anything but it's good for what it is you still see outside it blocks the wind and everything will block probably most of the rain of course but pretty good there's a cutout there for the motor and then all the the sides uh, can zip right up looks like doing pretty good and you can just pull right up to the dock or the uh, land and just jump right out the front so this is the uh, outside view of the winter canopy on the Aleco boat Aleco, Aleco however you want to say it it's a cutout for the uh, motor a neat, neat little setup. Keeps all you know most of the wind and rain and snow off of you. If that's uh, a little bit of a snow, we come out if it's snowing, raining, anything.